Hey everybody, this is Randy Polly. Uh, just wanted to show you the finished project, about 90% finished on our uh, chicken run and chicken coop ad adaptation uh, out here at Fort Chicks Farms. So as promised, here is the 95% uh, finished project. So on some of the previous videos, obviously you saw the larger chicken coop that was here when we got here. And you can see the tie-in to uh, the coop that we brought from our last property. And there's some of the noisy girls. They're all cooped up. And um, they're not real happy, but we've got a lot of predators here. So just to illustrate the top, um, we've got the vinyl coated rolled wire all the way across the top of the coop. Oh, girls, be quiet. And we have hardware cloth all along the bottom. And you can see that we've transitioned that hardware cloth down below. And if you look very closely, you can see that we also put the vinyl coated rolled wire along the ground so that fox cannot dig in there to, uh, to kill our chickens. And we've got uh, some fresh eggs today. Don't know if we have any people. Ah, some nice green eggs, brown eggs, Americanas. And so we've been dressing it out. Um, as you can see, uh, we've come a long way since the last video. Girls are happy. They got plenty of room to roam. We've put a uh, tarp on the top of it for both rain and for uh, keeping the food dry. And the, one of the only unfinished portions of the uh, run is this back section where we're going to be putting a double gate so that we can get in and out. And uh, it's important to note that we took this original coop and we have the ability to add a single panel underneath of that corrugated roof so that we can introduce new chickens to the flock and get them used to each other uh, prior to um, putting them all together. So this is just on the edge of our little orchard here. Uh, we've got plenty of uh, fresh fruit starting to come in on this uh, peach tree. Looks really good. And here's the back side. And we have nesting boxes in both coops. Say hi to YouTube girls. Rock, rock. Hey Wilma. <laughs> so it's important to note that um, you want to have your run um, tall enough so that you can walk in it. Uh, that's very important. We have um, made that mistake in the past. It costs a little bit more lumber, but um, it's well worth it. So there's the girls enjoying their new life at Fort Chicks Farm. We'll be planting our uh, late spring, early summer gardens very soon right down here. So uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And... Um, you keep watching cookingscool.com and we'll show you lots of great things about chickens and farming and anything you want to know. In Boca Lupo. See you soon.